Like a hug. <laughs> Home! What's up, y'all? My name is Crystal K. I'm a pop star in Japan, and through my eyes, I would love to show you the beauty of Japan. And today, I'm here to show you something we love to have during the summer. Bing! Kakigori! Shaved ice! I love this area. It's called Daikayama. It's a very, very famous shopping street. Um, I have never been here though. <laughs> I already love the outside aesthetic. It's kind of got a retro vibe with the denim noren. And it's called Urara, which is super cute. So let's check it out. <laughs> this is very classic old Japan. And also like the fonts from the old school Kirin beer and tobacco and candy and salt and all that stuff. It's super cute. All right, let's get that kakigori because it's hot as hell. Konnichiwa. Yoroshiku onegaishimasu. I love the outdoor seating, but you can also eat inside too. Hi. Wow. Oh wow, it's pretty spacious. Oh, oh. Hi. So this kind of traditional Japanese style shaved ice is like matcha and red beans on top. And this also comes with condensed milk. And then ichigo Ichigo Miruku, which is literally strawberry and condensed milk. So yummy. The recommendation, this one is organic blueberries from Shinonomachi in Nagano, served with homemade condensed milk, yummy. I think I want to try this blueberry one. And this one. <laughs> <laughs> we can share it with the staff. Oh, there's sizes? Matcha ore half niste. Blueberry or regular. And also, it's not just shaved ice, they also have udon here. So they opened 2018, so they've been around for, for six years. Until a year and a half ago, they were only serving shaved ice, even during the winter, all throughout the year. But they decided to um, serve udon and other foods. The udon menu is pretty good. Yeah, they got rice too. I don't really eat shaved ice. <laughs> Maybe only if I go to Matsuri or... Oh. Ah, but when I was a kid, I think I had a shaved ice machine at home and I would just That's make amazing. it, yeah. And I loved condensed milk and I'd be like... Oh my god. <laughs> a fatty. <laughs> This is half. <laughs> what? <laughs> this natural ice made in Nikko, Japan, they wait until it becomes ice, which takes about two weeks. So apparently, even if you eat quick, you won't get a brain freeze. Itadakimasu. <laughs> it's so good. Oishi. <laughs> wow. Perfect matcha bitterness and sweetness. 
Mmm. Matcha syrup's amazing. Okay, let's try it with the bean paste or the beans. Red beans on top. I think it's powder made from seaweed. So it's healthy. That's one thing I love about Japanese sweets. It's very healthy. It's not like rough shaved ice. It's so fine. I first ate the mazuki matcha kakigori. It doesn't melt as fast as like a regular ice, just normal ice. I guess because it forms gradually in the nature. I think this is the best shaved ice I've ever had in my life. <laughs> Yum! This is straight up matcha powder and agave. Ooh, this would go good with pancakes! <laughs> I wonder if shaved ice is popular in the U.S. Yeah, if you guys know, let me know in the comments. <laughs> if there's a shaved ice culture in the U.S. or Europe. I wonder if shaved ice started in Japan. Because it started in like the 800s. The earliest known record of shaved ice as a dessert is from Japan's Heian period. Yeah, so Go Japan! <laughs> In Yokohama, my hometown. In Bashamichi, right by my house. <laughs> <laughs> Dang! This is regular size. This blueberry syrup looks so yum. Oh my goodness, what am I gonna do with myself? There's real blueberries here too. This is huge. <laughs> so soft and fine, it just... Thank you, Maz. Bussin'. <laughs> mm. Oh my god, this is so lovely. Oh, totally different world. It's like a... Like a hug. <laughs> It's like a gentle sweetness. But the ice is so like tender and fine. And the sweetness, it's not overwhelming. So I think easily you can eat it by yourself. <laughs> yeah. And it's probably fun to like everyone get different flavors and, sh and share. Mm. You guys gotta try this. Mina Tabel. pick their blueberries in Nagano so there's like seven different types of blueberries when they pick it and so you can enjoy all different types like from one can be super sour one can be really sweet so it's like a rainbow of blueberries mm. demo that's so cool how in Back in the day, they used to shave it with a sword <laughs> or the katana. Mm. What did they bring? Their homemade condensed milk. Mm. A little bit to the center. Oh! Oh! No! Three second rule. <laughs> 
Yeah, I don't think there's a pretty way of eating shaved ice. It's just gonna go all over the place. Okay, so now that we have the additional blueberry, hand-picked blueberry Oh! The milk is, oh! Woo! Let's try it. Ah, oh, I know this is gonna be so good. Look at this. Combo. Wow. Wow, I ate a lot of It's so natural. Like the condensed milk you get at the store, it's so thick. Because <laughs> you know there's probably so many hozonryo. But it's so sara sara. Wow, guilt free this ne. Mm. So they boil the brown sugar and the milk for about an hour and a half to make the condensed milk. Mm. I think you guys would love this. I think this type of taste, this rich and mild sweetness, I don't think you can get that abroad <laughs> in the West because I think the sugar, the amount of sugar used in you know American sweets is just crazy. See, I think you guys can really enjoy this guilt-free Japanese style sweetness. Yeah, you guys definitely have to come here. It's so good. Mm. How did you like my kakigori video? It's so funny because as soon as we started recording, the cicadas started crying like really loud. But that's Japanese summer for you. I love this place. I'm gonna recommend this place to all my friends. Urara, make sure you guys check it out. If you're ever in Daikanyama, Tokyo, like, subscribe, and comment any questions you have. See you guys next time. Did